가만두지만 내게 컴인 컴인 투미 숨길 수 없어 널 인마해 채워줘 빈자리를 인마해 더 긴장하지만 내게 컴인 who is basically my Mariah Carey in terms of South <laughs> Korea. Like, he's, like, just, I'm obsessed with him. Hmm. This song live, by the way, I heard it live in 2020. Oh, yeah? Ooh! Yeah? Oh, this song's insane live. The bass. <laughs> That one from Hey, Justin Timberlake. There's a lot of harmonies in that. So. Yeah, this is big still. Super saucy. Yeah. They they really focused on rhythm on this um and mm. that boom 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 boom. Mm -hmm. Because and and like um there's like a synth sound layer in that bass it, and it's just doing a little passing chord before it goes on to the next one so it might be boom 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 bass going boom. Oh, but, but, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. But, but, but it's also quite old school as well, isn't it? Yeah, it just anticipates the beat and it makes mm. it makes you wanna. Oh yeah, it did mm. yeah. yeah, very old school. So what the, uh, the the main synth on the chorus is ducking. It, it's either ducking or they've just made it that way. But every time the kick goes, it goes mm, mm, like that. Riser. Mm. That wood block um, cush is nice. Nice reharm. Nice. Nice. Yeah. I wish, bit, wish that bit was longer, that was nice, yeah, proper. Yeah. <laughs> that one, I know it's a really small sound, but that wood block is changing the... the but why is the wood block, isn't it? Um, it's on the offbeat. Oh, can you hear it? Oh! 
<laughs> so it's kind of there on the first part of the it's chorus. Like a, it's like a clock. I'm kind of like a, a sign. Yeah. It's, um, yeah. it's actually called. Uh, it's like, it's like a xylophone almost. Not a. Uh, there, there's, it's, no, it's a woodblock. It's, wood block, it's, yeah. yeah, it's actually called a woodblock. So the first half of the chorus has the woodblock, and the second half doesn't. Or ah. the first half has it really quietly, or mm-hmm. just every now and again. And then when it comes yeah. back in, it actually has it. <laughs> So you can feel it, and then you hear it more as it goes on. Yeah. Okay, cool. So that was his, and that was in 2014. Okay, cool. So you wow. a song like that in 2014. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a big tune still. What I'm gonna do is I'll, literally. So what I'm gonna do is show you. Um, very high energy, so yeah. yeah, it's like it's like I'm here, isn't it? Um, so I want to do I'm gonna add uh, only taming gets three because it's taming, bro. So this is his song from 2020 called Criminal. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna say anything about it. <laughs> this is six years later, it's growing, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> So that arpeggio is going, doo-doo, 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 and yeah. as it's going, the filter is just slowly opening. That's why it's getting brighter. Mm. Yeah. Other as well, the sort of sounds. I like the, 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 guitar, the guitar sounds like it has no attack, so it sounds like it's been strummed, but without um, hearing the start of it. Mm. But it, it, it might actually be taken off during production because it's too quick to just. Yeah. You can't just do it from, yeah. But it might not be. The mm. guitarist might be good enough for this stuff. I would assume, just because of the style of track, that the kick is making all the um, uh, instrument sounds duck, which means to push it down every time it plays. So there's a little bit of like um, breathing space, almost like the, like the kick's breathing. With the kick, the drum, the drum kick. So yeah, the drum, every time on the one, it's it's how, it, down the music. It, it brings down every, like a slight bit just to keep the movement. Oh, got it, got it, got it, got it. But because it's not doing it on the vocal, you can't necessarily tell. Mm. If it was happening to the vocal as well, you you'd tell. hear it, yeah. Got the kicks right here, right in front of me. That um, I don't know what the sound is specifically, but it's going yeah, yeah. It has no low end, so you're just hearing that, and you're not fe- you don't feel it, but it's there. <laughs> you say it, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, it's like it's shiny. Glitch sound effects, trip hop. So there's there's a percussion sound of Plus you sound here the, um, that you can hear louder in this bit, but it's actually mimicking the um, when oh. it goes in the chorus. <laughs> but it's not the same rhythm, but it's kind of mimicking it. Okay, I'm so I'm 
<laughs> and I mean, the, the reason why I highlighted that is because the, um, it keeps the rhythm going. Because mm. if it was just like, just kick and, and clap, mm. it'd be a bit empty. Mm. But that, um, it, I don't know what the percussion is particularly doing, but, um, specifically doing, sorry. But when it comes back in with the, uh, it just fits perfectly, so. Mm. Yeah. And yeah, so that that sound is is way <laughs> above his vocal. So or not way above, but it's not like an octave or so above. And so it leaves space for his vocal and everything else is just like bass and beats yeah. and stuff. <laughs> That hand clap is like sounds just like one clap um, with loads of reverb or something. Um, yeah, it doesn't sound like I know, multiple. That's it's quite like, like, yeah. It or, doesn't or feel layered or through, nothing. Yeah. yeah, it just sounds like one or something like that with a maybe a really tight delay on it. Mm. And the reason why that's more important because obviously if you have multiple claps, it sounds like it's building. True. But when you got one so, one subtle. solitary clap. True. You've got that um, sense of intimacy, and obviously that's for the breakdown anyway. True, so. very true. Mm. Well, like a finger click. Yeah, click yeah. One clap, yeah. Exactly, and then you've got the bass pad rising, so mm. it would maybe, maybe rising in frequency or just moving generally, that keeps it going, keeps the track rolling. Oh, yeah. This scene here reminds me of um, Rush Hour. I can't, I, really? I, I can't remember the, when they're in the casino. Rush the first Rush Hour. Oh. When they're in the casino, he's got the drapes and he's trying to save Jackie Chan from falling. I don't remember. But yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. See how he filled up that space of his vocal. Yeah, that's what I wanted from the song okay. he reacted to. Yeah, because there was he kept it full in that center. Because I've no, listened to it, listen to it now again with your um, perspective in mind. That song doesn't go through much changes. It's yeah. actually very how it starts is pretty much how it ends. It, it caters, key change. Caters for his voice a lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah it's yeah, not yeah. like a song that's going through all these like crazy things which is crazy because he's part of SM as well okay. you know how SM do yeah. those bridges yeah, 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 but yeah. it doesn't really have that however yeah. the next song so this was, yeah. a this was a two part thing so Idea so this was like he did a double album the first album that was the main single and it had its own album with like nine songs mm -hmm. and then this one Idea was the next single that came out like three months later or four months later okay. with another another album with its own nine songs it's one song basically <laughs> Because when you see the video as well, it feels like this is like my final dance. Oh, I see. The nice chords. <laughs> Don't get bored of them, boy. Proper. They're strings as well. Interesting effect on the vocal because it's very washed um, with reverb and in the background, but like not. Mm. It's, it's, it's like in the middle of the track uh, and everything's around it. Oh, nice. So the synth sounds, even though it's brighter, um, it's, higher, it's higher in octave, sorry, it's, mm. it's lower in brightness. Mm. Okay! Oh, 
I mean, yeah. So the baseline is just to is really simple, but it's yeah. just effect, it's just Jeez. distorted and do just it's octaves. Do yeah. Dude, yeah. Rise Yes. Yes. Big. They say they made the chorus a rhythm instead of just just a chant or whatever, just the sing along thing. So yeah, that's nice. So that ah, that that's they actually use the vocals like almost like a synth. Um, that's quite nice. Almost like an instrument, I should say. Oh, I kind of like how you would skip it, yeah. How you would a synth? You would yeah. just kind of like modulate the wheel instead, but like yeah, yeah. yeah. What's the chord? Yeah. So that voice going killing me softly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Boa who's like. She's been in the industry. She debuted in like 2000. She's okay. a legendary artist. I don't think I've seen you any. I, I was going to say, like, Killing Me Softly something, right? Yeah. It's obviously also, Fuji's, but like... Yeah, but it's, it's, I guess it's, it's a, a few... It's a, it's a good phrase to use. It might be reference to that as well, because um, the lyrics are all about, like, his identity fighting with the battle of, like, his perception as an idol. All the, There's so many levels to it. Um, but he got her to sing that hook. Um, nice and it's Good like touch. she's a legend as well she's yeah. the same company um, she's still performing now she was actually in the song that you and Albert reacted to okay cool okay cool back. Okay. Uh, she was in that as well but I, was, nice. I think it was a nice touch to have her vocals yeah, just definitely. for that look just yeah. the little contrast yeah 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 yeah. I'd like stuff like that that's good But the thing is, uh, um, the, the sick thing about strings is that when they're by themselves like that, they and it's obviously doing. Yeah, mm-hmm. It's really it makes it even more eerie that it's just one string yeah, it's, doing yeah, that it's thing. So true, so yeah. true. Very compressed, mm. very midi. Mm. And then very reverby. <laughs> They've washed it quite a lot, but um, it's not. What, what, what is washing vocals? Um, so just um, loads of reverb and delay. Oh, okay, got it. Um, so it sits at, um, where they've they, so it's got less low end, and obviously men have uh, a bit more low end than mm-hmm, women. Mm-hmm. So it sits a bit brighter. So mm. it, it does actually sound quite nice with this because obviously the bass and the drums are doing the thing down Hello. below. Mm-hmm. All that, all that's reverb and and lack of um, low end. Ah. It, it's getting wetter actually. Um, it's getting more reverby. See, the difference between this and the other tracks and mm. stuff is it, it's just not in the same place. In the other tracks, the vocal's in the middle. Mm. This one's a little bit higher. Oh. And a little yeah. bit... It's, it's a little bit higher, but in the same depth. Mm. So it's in the same, like, back. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, so that's it's, it sounds quite nice where it is because it's a male vocal as well. Mm. With everything going on, that's why it doesn't sound overwhelming. Ah, it's more balanced. A, a bit more, yeah. Because there's a lot of hi-hats and stuff doing a lot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah, it's just, yeah. Oh, my God. It's just like... Yeah. Nice. And now that means, that's why... Because some things are so subliminal, like, you don't even know why you're 
you can pay attention to certain songs more than others because the balance yeah. is there. Yeah, yeah. Because that yeah, that, that never sounded overwhelming to me. It yeah. always sounded like good. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, like yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because you know the one I was saying that was um sorry like a lot. The, I don't remember which one it was. Um, the, the girl group one. Oh, Red Velvet. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. you when you listen back to it, you hear what I mean. Yeah, you're yeah, overwhelmed. Yeah. There's too much. There's, there's, there's so much going on oh, in the chorus. Yeah. So yeah, do not over touch it because that is there's a lot going on, but it's yeah. so well balanced. That's such yeah. A good point. Let let things do what they're doing. Like the bass is giving breathe. you energy. The vocals cater into the song. Mm. The drums giving you life. Like just let it do it. Mm. And the beefies are there too. Yeah, That's yeah. Really all yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah, like I said, the vocals are in a bit more of a different place, mm. but it sounds better there. I of would the say. of the three, was that your favorite? Uh, this. This one, this one's the favorite. Sorry, uh, doesn't well, remind you of um, Thriller as well, by the way. N- um, in, in fact, no. Thriller. Criminal is is my fa- it is actually probably more the favorite, mm. more because of how it's well it's put together and thought mm. about. Mm. They've really kind of gone for a concept. Yeah, it feels more like a single mm. as well. Um, I get that. Like a lead single and stuff. I don't, I don't know because the idea, I would probably listen to idea more though. <laughs> yeah, so that's so, why I do literally. Yeah. Look, yeah, but also would, I do love the video for idea. Right. I know, I know right. what you mean. I know yeah, what you mean. Yeah. Judith first, thanks for listening. <laughs>